Hey everyone, this is me, Reese here from the Games for Life channel, and today I'm going to be doing a little review, not a game video, but a little review, something you could use with gaming if you wanted to. Um, it's in the entertainment category, the Skull Candy Hesh headphones. Now, I just opened these up now. That was the package, came with two little stylish boxes. Uh, kind of hard to open up, but anyways, let's continue on to it. Now, Skull Candy, these are pretty much for people who love bass in their music. Um, I've tried these out before. They're pretty good. They're not bad. Um, there's other headphones which they are similar to Hesh, but um, I find that they're too expensive and Hesh is better. Alright, first, go on the design. It's actually pretty comfortable. It's durable. Put it out there. Put it out there. It's plastic, so I wouldn't go around bending it. It is durable. The top's got soft padding here. Earmuffs are pretty soft. I felt softer, but they're pretty cushiony here. Not bad, not really irritating, and they're circular, so not really for types of ears. But anyways, um, and now the sound quality is pretty good on these headphones. They're not bad at all. It's, um, as I said before, people who really love bass. Um, there's other different models of Skull Candy. Uh, I've got a list here. There's different ones like Uprock. People, a lot of people have them, but they're not that good compared to Hesh. They're around, it's around thirty dollars Uprock on eBay or something. I don't know on retail, but um, I think you're better off spending the extra thirty dollars um, buying Hesh because the base is pretty much worth it. Um, there are ones that are more expensive, like GI and Aviator, sorry if I said that wrong, which, um, they look cool, they've got different designing, um, I've tested them, tested them out before, they're not, they are better, I guess, but, um, Hesh is less expensive, some of them, the Aviators range up to $249, as Hesh is just easy, 70 bucks, um, the cord, I don't know exactly how long it is. Um, it's gold plated, so it's pretty cool. Um, a lot of the other editions came with another jack which you can put on for guitars and etc. But um, this one doesn't come with it. There's another edition of uh, Hesh which come with a microphone around here, but I didn't get that one. Um, it comes with a little travel pack, Skull Candy logo on it, which is pretty. Neat. And it came with a sticker, but I, I think I lost it already. Um, and on the boxes, it says Hesh. Big cans with big sound. It's a driver 50mm. And what else does it say? The instructions here. I'm going to get a little skull candy thing here. Um, yeah, the sound quality, the bass, and everything makes it really good. There's other brands which. Uh, a shitload expensive, say around $400, um, different ones, HP, Dr. Dre Beats or something, they're around 200 and something dollars, and I find that Hesh is more better. Um, from personal experience, I've tried them before, I just opened it out, I haven't tested these ones before, but um, I know from experience, Hesh are better. Um, it's, as I said before, it's durable, it's comfy at the top, comfy for the ears, pretty soft, you can extend it out here, um, watch out for these because if you do accidentally sit on it, you could break it easily, it's not metal, a lot of other headphones, the expensive brands are metal, but um, these ones are pretty good, they've got the fancy logo, good design, and yeah, so all up, these headphones are pretty good, they're not bad at all, they beat a lot of other headphones, a lot of bass, when you put it to the max volume, and the song is in high definition, you're going to get a good, very good um, quality sound. So guys, hope you enjoyed the review. They're $69.95 in Australia, which is pretty cheap. I think you can get them around $50 on eBay. I'm not too sure, um, but I think that's in America. So if you're Australian, um, I think you can get them in your local JB Hi-Fi. Um, bought them there. They're pretty good. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this review and... Look forward to maybe more of these after. Don't forget to subscribe.